Most people enter the spiritual path and they're basically already moving. They're, they're in a velocity, if you will. So, I mean, my version of that was I come straight out of the M&A world and all of that kind of high-level activity. So, I mean, I'm moving and I show up in India. Well, I get in India, I come in at like three in the morning, you know, seven o'clock the next morning, I'm up and I'm headed into the o ashram opens at seven and Alan's there at the fucking door at seven in the morning. Cause you know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a business dude. You know, I'm here to, I'm here to make, I'm here, I'm in velocity. So of course they're like, no, go get some rest, you know? And I'm like, okay, next morning, seven o'clock in the morning, guess what? I'm there again, baby. So I'm in there every day, bugging the hell out of them. Finally they get- But this is Osho's ashram. This is ashram. Osho's ashram. Yeah. So I'm in Osho's ashram and finally, and you know, I've told you the story about what, you know, what's enlightenment. And I made a list and said, I'm going to start at the top, go to the bottom. When I'm done, I'm enlightened. How else does this shit happen? That's how everything happens. But one of the smart guys finally said, he says, you know what? We need to just put this dude somewhere, right? Because he's going to keep coming back every morning at seven and bugging the hell out of us. And we don't need that. So they put me in a, and I'd never done this in my life. Imagine this. I'm in a, they put me in a 21 day primal group in silence. That's my first spiritual three days into India. And, and the merger acquisition dude is now in a 21 day in silence primal group. Right. And, and let me tell you that, that, that got rid of me for 21 days. They didn't, they didn't have to deal with me anymore, but just the, just walking into that and then watching how, you know, people were trying to, in some way, shape or form, break that velocity. Right. And, and I, I had no idea that that was what we were up to. Like in all the, all the studying yeah. and everything I'd done, the, you read all this stuff, but you don't get, you know, you can't look at yourself and say, oh, when you're in velocity, man, everything is, is, is clipping on every, you know what I mean? It's the spark plugs are all firing. Right. And you can't see anything because yeah. the faster you go, the more velocity you are, the more glue of identification is right, is cooking with you. And so it takes, it, yeah. it's like, so anybody who's in the seek, who's getting into the seeking mode. You take a look at your velocity because spiritual seeking is not obtaining something like you've obtained ever before. It's, it's actually um, slowing the velocity down enough that you sink into what is. So it's already there. And that's the crazy thing about yes. the whole thing is, is to be able to, you know, change that because in your mind, you're going to no, I got it that it's here, but you're really, but you're still going hundred miles an hour. So at hundred miles an hour, right. what's here? There's nothing here at hundred miles an hour. I'm here to tell you.